Do your little uh, Champ Bailey, uh, him taking a shot at me. I think that I, I'm just asking. Did, did did you take a little a, a little subception to that? I did take exception to it because, but I don't think he was taking a shot at me. But if he was, uh, more power to him, and he can get this work if you know if he really wants to have a debate with me about any of this stuff he's talking about. Because sitting there, uh, those of us. And particularly in 2019, when he made that speech, and he's sitting out basically caping up for Michael Brown, Trayvon Martin, wh- whomever, uh, we got bigger issues than that. And we have bigger issues than fighting and screaming every time somebody uh, fights with the police. Look, Michael Brown grabbed that policeman's gun. And, and, according to the Obama Department of Justice, uh, prove, like, man, uh, Darren Wilson was justified in what he did. And everybody in that neighborhood knows that he, Darren Wilson was justified. And and I hate to say this because it's, it's, it's sacrilege at this point now, but I, I'm going to say it. I've seen some documentaries on Trayvon Martin that'll blow your mind. That Trayvon Martin ain't the victim that they make him out to be. There's documentaries with real strong proof he whooped George Zimmerman's ass and was banging his head against concrete, and there's a reason why George Zimmerman walked. And and the facts are the facts. And I'm just and 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 they <laughs> there's a doc. Somebody go look up the documentary where they <laughs> the, they brought they created Ben Crump. And the police or whatever put the prosecutors put a, this woman on the Please stand. Please never call that man for me. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, you know. So anyway, watch some documentaries on. So Champ Bailey is he an idiot? Yes, he is an idiot in my view. And 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 I, I just I love and Jim. Everybody knows my dating history. I'm not. Everybody knows I got no problem with interracial dating. I got no problem with white women. Everybody knows that. You know, I don't. I don't run from that. But damn it, I'm tired of these guys. If you watch Champ Bailey's speech, I'm tired of these guys getting up, what having a pro-black say? moment. What you great say, man? And he kept calling out to his little young, tenderoni, uh, 25-year-old white woman that he's married to. And I- I'm just, I got no problem with it. Hats off to you, Champ Bailey. But you're not Malcolm X. You didn't marry Betty Shabazz. You married Becky. And but- <laughs> that's, that's just facts. And, and I'm not trying to disparage any of those people. You, I live a very transparent life. I'm not trying to disparage, but I'm just getting tired of it. What's All that phrase? These, What's your phrase? Uh, they, 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 they like to claim blackness, but they want to participate in the fruit. What's that phrase? Yet? The phrase is they, they love the fruit, but hate the tree. <laughs>